Hey, this is GI. I think I have a patient who's having a GI bleed. He just had a large episode of melanin. Melanin? Describe it. Black, loose, sticky, kind of tar-like. You're sure it's black and not just dark brown? Yeah. Did you get a good look at it? It smelled really bad. But is hemoglobin stable? No, it dropped from like 11 to 8 this morning. Looks like 8 is his baseline, right? That's where he was in June of 2020. But that's back when he was having a previous GI bleed. Could be dilutional. His platelets dropped a lot too. 220 to 212? How much fluid did you give him? And his white blood cell count went up. Did you rule out hemolysis? His LDH was normal. What about haptoglobin? I'm getting a page from his nurse. He just vomited blood. Like coffee ground? Looks like he had esophagitis on his last EGD. It could just be from that. He also had a massive gastric ulcer and he's continued to take ibuprofen three times a day. And his haptoglobin was normal? Okay, the nurse says it's red blood and he's still vomiting. Is she sure he's not coughing up the blood? Maybe he needs a bronchoscopy. He's persistently retching. Probably just a Mallory Weiss tear. So what should I do? Do we have recent iron studies? Okay, now the nurse is saying his blood pressure is 80 over 40. Could he be septic? Oh no. Now he's unresponsive. I'm gonna go check on him. Sounds like he's too unstable for a scope anyway. And I still don't see any recent haptoglobin.